Hey guys, it's AR15 Guy. So I've had a great weekend. Um, like you saw, kind of into the introduction a little bit. Uh, me and my wife at the uh, OSU game had a blast. They won. They're 6-0, and baby. So we're pretty stoked about that. Uh, first time I've gotten to actually go down and see a game. Just been so busy with other things that haven't got, gotten a break free and get down there. So we got to go down there and uh, watch the game. Had a great time. It's loud. It's a blast. Um, I'd encourage anybody, no matter where you live, if you enjoy football at all, go and watch uh, a good college game. It's just just a ton of fun. And uh, one of the things, um, one of the things that I did is, so I kind of had my rant on uh, uh, Friday night about my experience at Walmart, right? So. I said, all right, I'm going to try something different. I'm going to go to Fred Meyer's. There's a Fred Meyer here in town, and uh, they're kind of more expensive. But I thought, well, the customer service would be better. So I went to Fred Meyer's, and uh, I was like, I got my stuff. I didn't see a single employee the whole time I was in there. Um, I got my stuff. I even bought a pair of shoes. Um, and when I went up to pay for it, I had bought my wife an OSU sweatshirt. Um, and, uh, you saw my beautiful wife in the videos. Um, I bought her an OSU, a new OSU sweatshirt because hers were getting kind of, kind of gringy. And, uh, but it was missing the tag on the side. So the lady's like, well, I need to get a tag. So she's like, I'll call somebody. She calls somebody and we wait and we wait we wait and we wait and nobody calls her back and she's like well why don't you go grab one with a tag and I'm thinking to myself the checker right next to us didn't have anybody in line so why would you have a customer go back to get something that wasn't his fault that wasn't on there to begin with or so why wouldn't you either have them or do it yourself? It wasn't that far away. I mean, it was across the store a little ways, but why wouldn't you? And so I go get one, and I bring it back, and she's like, oh, no, that's not the right size. You have to get the right size. So I had to go back, look for the right size, hope that they had the right size, walk all the way back, and I'm thinking to myself this whole time, she could have had the gal that was running the check register right next to her do it, or she could have done it herself. And then I got to remember, and not to put down unions, but these Fred Myers and Safeway are are union workers. The workers inside the stores are union, and it just seemed like you got to be kidding me. I mean, this Fred Myers is an expensive store, and so you would think that you're paying if you're going to pay that much for products that you could pay less for at another store, that you at least get some decent customer service out of the deal. Anyway, long story short, I wasn't happy with Fred Myers either. And it's, I'm not really hard to please. I just expect people to do their job. I'm not one of these customers that expects to get everything for free and, and all of that stuff. I just expect that your customer service, part of what you do if the customer is not being unreasonable, is serve the customer. So, anyway, so that's a quick video, but I had a blast at the game. Me and the wife had a great time at the game. Um, really enjoyed it. I would encourage anybody out there to, you know, some of us in the prepping move it kind of prepping thing kind of get caught up in prepping and getting things ready and doing this and doing that. But we don't take time to just enjoy life the way it is right now. Um, you know, things are going to, uh, there's probably going to be a shift. There's probably going to be some changes that come your way. You know, stop and take in the moment and enjoy right now. And so I definitely suggest you take that time to do that with your families. And, um, so anyway, like I said, had a great uh, had a great time. There's some pictures to some corny music because I'm still working on my editing skills. So some corny music at the beginning of the video. Um, one of me and my wife, one of the the field, um, and then one of my beautiful wife by herself. So anyway, hope you guys uh, enjoy the video. Take it for what it's worth. Have a good night. Thanks for watching.